The president was speaking at a conference on rediscovering nitrogen solutions and synergies for climate change, health, biodiversity and circular economy. A side event at the 2021 United Nations Climate Change Conference or COP26 held in Glasgow, Scotland. Overuse of nitrogen, especially in fertilizers, has adverse impact on soil, water, air and human health. For decades, chronic kidney disease has been a serious issue in Sri Lanka's agricultural heartland. The overuse of chemical fertilizers has contributed significantly to this problem. It is in this context that my government took firm steps to reduce imports of chemical fertilizer and strongly encourage organic agriculture. Although this action has been broadly appreciated, it has also met with some criticism and resistance. In addition to chemical fertilizer lobby groups, this resistance has come from farmers who have grown accustomed to overusing fertilizer as an easy means of increasing yields. This is particularly unfortunate considering Sri Lanka's rich agricultural heritage. The challenge facing us now is to use modern scientific techniques and practices to enhance agricultural production without causing environmental degradation. We require a new agricultural revolution that has sustainability at its core. President Gotabi Rajapaksa is expected to address the World Leaders Summit at COP26 tonight.